X10D's sensor capabilities are definitely superior to the other sensors in its class. But I think that the thing that makes them the most differentiating is what it adds to the mission. Having a persistent capability that provided ISR that built, we'll call it just situational awareness of your immediate battle space is exceptionally important, not just day but night as well, to keep our people safe. So the X10D, um, it's really going to meet all the requirements right now, especially in a drone of this size and class. We have the 64 megapixel narrow camera and the 48 megapixel telephoto. That as a package hasn't existed ever in a drone of this class. The ability for a uh, Skydio aircraft to maintain distance well outside the audible range and still get the sensor fidelity that they need on target, I think is what makes it the most impactful. It also allows you to do more high fidelity things like tracking at long distances um, and being able to show what sensor data you need from the target from a longer range. Now if I can bring that organic ISR capability down to the warfighter at the tactile edge, like the very far edge of the battle space, um, I don't have to rely on a very expensive airplane with a person in it. I can take the information and inform decisions that can then open up the entire battle space. One of the major steps up in technology between X2D and X10D is actually the thermal camera. The 640 Boson Plus, there's nothing like it in its class. Um, to be able to have a radiometric thermal on something that's backpack portable is really incredible. For the thermal camera, we have a very high sensitivity sensor, so that's going to give us the ability to see when there's very low temperature differences across your scene. Sometimes you, you get a high resolution camera that just doesn't work well in low light or just doesn't work well even in nominal conditions. We've really upped our game with the way we're doing tuning and we're just comparing to other systems and we're just outperforming them. And I, I think that's testament to really optimizing for our use cases. With the fidelity and the sensor capabilities of the X10D, whether it's day or night, now we can start making better and more informed decisions that once again maintain safety for my fighting force, my warfighter.